I got a question for you. Are you or your shop in the ADOS business? That is, are you involved in the service, repair, replacement, troubleshooting, or calibration of any of the advanced driver assist system components that are on your customers' vehicles today? Well, you may be shaking your head no, but I'm telling you, you should be shaking it yes. And you can find out why in this special edition of The Trainer. Today's edition of The Trainer is sponsored by Autel. Autel is a leader in ADOS calibration and service equipment. Learn more at www.maxisysados.com. ADOS is an aftermarket acronym that stands for Advanced Driver Assist Systems. This covers a wide variety of systems on the vehicle, all designed to assist the driver in maintaining control of the vehicle in a variety of accident scenarios primarily caused by driver inattention. Included in this family are systems you are certainly familiar with, like interlock braking and traction control. But some may be systems you haven't been exposed to yet, like collision avoidance and active cruise control. At least, not that you've been aware of. I'm fortunate enough to be able to meet shop owners and technicians from around the country. And one question I'm asking lately is, are you or your shop involved in the ADOS business? Again, do you perform any kind of service, repair, calibration, anything that involves these advanced driver assist systems? And usually the answer is no. But then I ask them, does your shop offer wheel alignment service? Do you do any type of front end work, suspension, steering components? Do you do tire service? Do you do AC work? And invariably the answer comes back, of course we do. To which I reply, well, you're in the ADOS business, whether you like it or not. Today's cars have been equipped with the ability to see the world around them using cameras and a variety of radar systems. And when they leave the factory, they are calibrated to look in a very specific direction. And any service that your shop performs on these vehicles that alters that line of sight, even a little bit, is going to impact how those ADOS systems are able to function. Take, for example, front collision avoidance. This system is designed to monitor the traffic in front of the driver and to take preemptive action should the system detect that the driver is about to impact the vehicle in front of them. This is the point in the video where every shop owner and technician watching needs to pay close attention. It's only a matter of time before you or your tech is held liable as a result of an accident involving a vehicle that you serviced that's equipped with these systems. Either your failure to calibrate the system after your repair or incorrectly performing the calibration. The difficulty is that these systems are still, relatively speaking, in their infancy stage. And finding out information on what the services you perform, in fact, what systems on the vehicle, what you need to do to correct them, can be very difficult to find in one specific place. Calibration procedures vary, system components vary, even their names haven't been standardized yet. And while many of the popular service information systems are making it easier to identify when a service is going to require some type of ADOS related calibration, it's still not as complete as it needs to be. Well, Autel is making this a lot easier. Autel is a leader in the automotive aftermarket when it comes to dealing with ADOS, offering a full spectrum of specialized equipment and technical support to shops wanting to calibrate in-house. For example, their newest solution is the new IA900WA, an all-in-one ADOS calibration and wheel alignment system. Want more information? Visit www.maxisysados.com. And even if you don't want to do calibrations in-house, you want to refer to the local dealer or you want to enlist the aid of an ADOS calibration specialist in your area, Autel still offers some help 
in identifying these systems. For example, on the MS-919, when you perform a full system scan and then look at the report, every module on the vehicle that's tied to an ADOS system is identified. Simply perform a full system pre-scan of the vehicle and open the report. Modules that are part of a related ADOS system are called out, and knowing what the car has on it makes it easier to identify what, if any, calibration steps you need to take prior to returning the vehicle to your customer. Ignorance is no excuse, and failure to either perform a calibration or performing that calibration incorrectly relating to a service or repair that you made to the vehicle is going to leave you open to potential liability in the event of a vehicle accident. If you want to find out more about the Autel ADOS system, visit www.maxisysados.com. And if you'd like to find out more about the line of Autel Diagnostic Tooling, visit www.autel.com. And as always, thanks for watching.